Hi, and welcome to another video from me, Ragga the Trainer and creator of myintickbuddy.co.uk. Now you may have seen, I recently shared um, this particular thing link, which I've created as a virtual business card. Uh, the idea being that it's got the links to all of the things that people might need. Uh, and all they need to do is scan using their QR code reader or their camera to be able to collect all of my contact details for my Etic Buddy. So for example, if we click on the Twitter here, we get the option to follow. And you can see it takes us straight to the Twitter profile. Again, if we click on to, say for example, TikTok, that's going to take us through to the profile page. There we go. And if we click on home, for example, that's going to take us to the website. And from there, you've got all of the links that you might need. So lots of different options and lots of different ways of using this. But I wanted to show people how I went about creating it. So the first thing I did is created a thing link. So I'm just going to go back to my main page. And all I needed to do was, first of all, just to create a thing link. So I just create using an image. It's going to allow me to upload from my files. Um, and I just want, uh, say, for example, a blank theme. Let's go with that one. See what that looks like. There we go. Perfect. OK. So I'm going to select that and I'm going to continue. I'm going to create a name. This is going to be business card demo in this case. And it's created my thing link for me. OK, now at the moment it's blank. But what I want to do first of all is to collect the um, sharing link. OK, so I'm just going to basically go to actually before we do that need to change the privacy settings so I'm going to make it public then I'm going to go and get my sharing link and the reason I need this is because that's what I'm going to use now you can see there's a QR code generator here so you can use this automatically so you can generate that QR and it will give you this one which is fantastic and if you want to you can screenshot that um, or you might want to particularly use uh, a specific color with it and you can choose whether you want to hide the thing link uh, interface or not so i'm just going to copy that and i'm going to come through here and i'm going to come out the thing link now and i'm going to go into uh, qr code generator just around uh, just a, a website i'm going to put the link in there to the thing link and you'll notice it starts to generate but you can see here you've got the option for changing colors so i'm going to change it to a purple uh, so it fits and you can also um, make it fit your logo if you like or you can add scan me in there just to make things really clear and then we can download it as a vector or download it as a JPEG okay but that's going to link directly to our uh, thing link I'm just going to download that so you see QR code is being generated and it's begun to download there okay so that's that stage completed we can close the website now now I'm going to take this theme and I'm going to add to it in Canva so I'm going to go to Canva you've got loads and loads of templates and I'm going to use a business card template and you can see here you can create a blank business card or you can use a design that already exists I'm just going to for the sake of today create a blank one I'm going to upload that image as my logo, that image as my QR, uh, and I might also um, upload from my device as well that blank background, there we go, the blank theme, just to give it that background image there. I'm going to add that in going to make it the full size and we can just move it around till we're happy with the sizing of it there we go and we can then move it to the back if we right click on here we can send it to the back okay so there we go we've got the startings of our business card so all I'm going to do now is click download 
Uh, it gives you the option of PDF print, but I'm going to go JPEG because I want it to go into the thing link. And I'm just going to download that. Thing link with the QR text here. So now what I'm going to do, I'm going to replace. So now what I'm going to do, I'm going to replace. Oh, sorry. I'm going to, where are we? Replace the background image with this newer version that I've just downloaded, untitled design. And now we've got the scan me in there and the logo. And from here I can start to edit and add. So I can go to add a tag, add text and media. I can choose an icon. So for example, if I wanted to add my Twitter, I can choose the Twitter logo and I can choose a color for it. So I'm gonna go with the blue. It can add a text in here and I can put in the URL that people would need to follow. So twitter.com forward slash my edtech buddy would be what they need to follow. Uh, and the button text, I'm just gonna say here, follow us, okay? And I can just click done on that and then move that into wherever I want it. And then we can continue to do that with lots of different examples. So if we now take that share, take that share link and we copy it and I open it in an incognito window. And just wait for that to load. Here we go. And there we go and we can see we've got the scan me option here and it starts to pulse away and that's available on any device for people to access and they can just click on the links and you can add as many links as you like you can even upload your own icons um, using svgs and you can create those using google drawings if you want so a really handy way of creating uh, a virtual business card give it a try <laughs>